The Art of Imitation Learning Long Horizon Manipulation Tasks from Few Demonstrations Given a set of five Long Horizon Task Demonstrations, our method Tapas Jim M first segments them into a sequence of skills, like grasping the cup, placing it on the machine and pulling the lever. The segmentation aligns the skill trajectories temporally, as well as allowing us to learn local skill models. This is not only more efficient, but also enables us to parameterize each skill individually, leading to superior performance. Additionally, as we will demonstrate later in the video, it allows us to sequence these skills in novel ways. We utilize a single wrist-mounted RGBD camera to localize a set of key points in this scene. Tabas GMM uses the key points as candidate task parameters and selects the relevant parameters per skill. We then fit one model per skill and cascade the skill models to generate full task trajectories. As we also demonstrate later in the video, generating the candidate task parameters from visual observations enables Tapas GMM to generalize across object instances, clutter and task environments. You can see the robot solving this long horizon coffee making task in real time. We evaluate a method on a set of challenging tasks, including pick and place, pouring, sweeping, opening a cabinet, storing an item in a drawer, making coffee and baking bread. These pose a variety of challenges, such as high precision manipulation, long horizons and articulated objects. Tapas GMM learns new tasks in less than 10 minutes. Even for long horizon manipulation, it requires just five demonstrations and training needs a few minutes as well. Through our use of scene key points as task parameters, our policies generalize zero shot to unseen object instances, task environments and cluttered scenes. The pouring tasks, for example, was trained using the single red can and purple cup. Yet our policy robustly generalizes to this wide array of different cans, bottles and cups with different shapes, colors and sizes. Or consider the pick and place task, for which we not only demonstrate generalization to a set of unseen bolts, but also to new clutter objects and a changing task environment. Our skill sequencing approach does not require the skills to be executed in the demonstrated order, but allows for novel skill sequences as well. Consider the make bread task, to consist of taking out the tray and placing the bread. By swapping the order of these skills and inverting their direction, we can for example solve the new task of taking off the bread and placing the tray in the oven without additional training. The deep learning baselines, LSTM and Diffusion, almost completely fail to learn any of the tasks from five demonstrations. Meanwhile, the TPGMM baseline struggles with gripper timing and post precision. This leads to failed grasps and to collisions with scene objects. You can see TPGMM struggling on all tasks, irrespective of their duration, yet problems aggravate if the task becomes more complex. This is because it does not take into account the temporal alignment of the skills and because it contaminates all skills by relevant task parameters. In contrast, Tapas GMM properly aligns the skills in each task and parameterizes each skill individually, leading to robust performance across all tasks. For the remainder of the video, we show footage of our method successfully solving all tasks. If you're interested in Tabas GMM, please visit our project website where you can find more details as well as the full source code. Thanks for watching.